Hi friends, today we are going to check how we can make a certain field mandatory in uh, in purchase order screen. Okay, so let me tell you what I'm uh, what we are going to do. So I'm going to me 22 and suppose and suppose I pick a purchase order. So I'll pick this one, not this one. I'll check another one. Which so here you can see this is the purchase order okay and here for some reason i want this payment terms to be mandatory okay so let me show you what we are going to do i'm just clicking here i made some changes and then i click here okay and when i click here it will show me the messages right that 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 appears so no message issued during check so that this is fine so, but I want this particular payment terms to be mandatory at this point. So, if I click on save now, it will just save it, right? So, let me let me go and it's, it just got saved. You see, this the purchase order got saved. But I want the payment terms to be always mandatory here. Okay. So, what, where will I have to do it? So, I'll just create a new session. Okay. I create a new session. And the transaction code is you can go through SDRO, but I'll show you a trick. OLME. I just go here. And here, once we go to OLME, now we go to purchase order. Okay. Once we go to purchase order. And this, this process is both in SAP, ECC, as well as S4 HANA. There is no, there is no change. Okay. Just to let you know. So define screen layout here you will see something related with transaction code but here you have to go it on the document type level so the document type is npf here uh, for purchase order here i'll just click details okay and once i hit details now i have to locate where it is so it is in the terms of delivery and payment if you notice so let me show you the previous screen okay that's pretty easy delivery invoice you see it's here so now what i'm going to do i'll just make terms of payment mandatory i don't know why they have put this check uh, check box probably you can select two i don't know it should be radio button uh but nevertheless we go hit the back button okay and now mm, we will just hit the back button and then it will ask for a customizing request because it's a configuration change okay and and so here now we have changed it now let's go and we will test it okay now we'll go to change mode okay and we'll put a g and we'll try to save it and it got saved but it didn't give an error message probably it, i was in the same session so that's why so let me go out back out completely and go to me 22 n and now i go and suppose i change this i make this error here i will see enter currency is there so it will say enter currency and here now it shows so you have to go out from the error message now it shows enter payment terms you see enter payment terms now it shows okay so you have to back out completely and then do it then you get the message because you are in the same session okay so this way you can make certain fields all the fields if you want based on your requirement mandatory based on the doctor okay so that's it. Stay tuned to my SAP channel and happy SAP learning and have a great day.